So. All right, Thomas. So going into game two for you, you're going back to back. You, you feel like you you're a little worn out, or are you, you up for this? Uh, th I think I'm up for this right now. You know, I'm warmed up, feeling good. Uh, it's just gonna be hard though. He likes to move around, mm -hmm. use the whole court. So uh, I just gotta stay tough out there, keep my stamina up, and uh, be a good game. Okay. Stamina staying up for Thomas. That's his game plan. And for the the geezer, what are um, we doing? What's going on here? You're playing Thomas. You saw his hand <coughs> last his game. Hand? Yeah. Oh, I see. <laughs> um, yeah. No, I mean I've seen his hand. So I actually, of the people I played against at all recently, Thomas and I played a couple games, close games uh, at uh, my mom's house. Um, so I think I know what he's capable of. Uh, I do remember him getting a, a lot of blocks on me just because I'm, mis I'm miscalculating his uh, his wingspan. Mm. Um, but yeah, he's a lanky I mean, fella. He's a lanky fella. Uh, stamina is usually my game. It's clearly not going to be uh, so much now. Although um, I think uh, Zach and I are I mean, a little different style of, or I should say, a different um, level. Of uh, experience in our play, and so maybe the stamina hopefully will kind of come into play there, from a veteran status standpoint. Um, but mm -hmm. we'll see. So, All, right. All right, game three coming up. Yeah. Okay. Thomas gets ball. Should be a good, uh, should be a good hustle board game. Let's we'll see how it goes. Good yeah. Thomas opening right up with a three. Yeah. Off the back of the rim. Shell down low. Tries to throw it off Thomas. Nothing doing. <laughs> Didn't I call that earlier? <laughs> hey, hustle. What are you seeing for this game, Dan? Well, it's evenly matched. The, you know, if yeah, Thomas it, hits the threes, there's really no stopping him until he's stopped hitting threes. down low. Yeah, if Thomas is hitting that outside shot, he's a tough, tough guy to guard. Not like he's gonna blow by you if you're up on him, but yeah. he can still he can still take you down low, and if he's getting that outside shot. He's got the fadeaway, the one leg fadeaway, that even if yeah. you are playing up on him, he can still, he just, Does he throw it out and try to like kick you with it? Uh, it well, <laughs> I think it used to be that, that yeah, yeah that you would get kicked, but it's, I think he's perfected it oh. so it's not as hard kicking. Got a little skin on there, and a he skin. banks it in. 3-2. Time is up. A lot of running. <laughs> oh, from two feet behind the three-point line, nothing. Thomas is running all over that court right now, but pays off with another three. Six to two. He is all about it. It's not just his virtual game. <laughs> So we got six to two. Oh Mitch's ball. Oh. The signature lefty mini hook drive. Not, not, not working so far. Down low in the post, nothing. Six to two. Sun at that perfect position where it's not in your in your eyes when you're shooting. Nice uh, upper 70s day.
I'm thinking three for Thomas. Wait. And yeah. Yes. Nine to two. All of Thomas's points have been on three so okay. far. And three ball. Three another. Nine to two, yes. Thomas looks like he may have gone a bit cold. He may want to think about, oh, slap and no call and bucket. 11 to 2. Oh, that was, that was ugly. Thomas is hitting that cold spot now, I think. He's like Orchard Beach. You may hit one spot that's really warm and then another spot will be really cold. <laughs> Two feet away. <laughs> I'm gonna call you Orchard Beach. That's your name. <laughs> Orchard Beach very uh eleven two. Eleven to two, yes, Thomas. Oh, missed with his second bucket. Eleven to four. That was a big one, because if Thomas uh, if Thomas would have kept going, that that would have been a big discrepancy. But now 11 to 4 doesn't seem so bad. It's only a couple buckets away. Tying it up. It's hard to go inside on him because even once you get inside, you, just, you turn around and see your face. Yeah, Thomas has got that like Scotty Pippen yeah. versatility. Very large yeah. wingspan. Yeah. Oh, nice. I'm body, surprisingly on body. 11 6. Mitch has got that John Paxson jumper. <laughs> Eleven to eight. Oh, who's a lefty? Maybe that might work better for Mitch. He's got uh, the Nick v v Van Axel jumper. Ah, uh, okay, yeah, Nick Van Axel. Very short. Like, very yeah, yeah, yeah. Almost, Mitch almost takes it behind the yeah. head like Nick <laughs> used to. Thirteen eight, Thomas. Oh, big oh. one. Thirteen eleven. See if Mitch can get a hot hand going. A lot of hustle in this game. It's hard to call that travel. It seems like a travel when he's down there. You gotta be looking. Yeah. Looking 
Two points away from halftime. It's a nice, nice little breeze. Yeah. <laughs> Much appreciated. Oh, a double. Double on yeah. Thomas. He's not used to backing down in the post like that. Lankers, his arms. Mitch down low, a lot of reaching in going on, a lot of bumping. Thomas gets the hustle board and throws up a throws up a three and nails it. 16-11. Darren, why don't you get out there and, and do the halftime interview for these guys? So, how was it out there? It's pleasant, you know, a little bit cloudy. Just what you want. No, he's playing well. Um, the three. Going over to get drinks. Oh, yeah. The, uh, over here? The three game was surprising. Um, not the number he made, but right. I guess I just let him slide on it because I thought that would be to my advantage. We'll see. See what happens. Looks like you're leading at the half again. Yep. You got anything to say about that? Yeah, Mitch is uh, tough out there. He's making me move around like, a, like I knew he would. Uh, get me really so, tired. Well, you're making me also with this camera. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's, he's getting me tired out there. He's really good. I don't feel comfortable with any lead. So I know he could get hot and drain a lot of uh, quick good shots. But uh, I'm getting lucky out there and hopefully I can put it all, pull it off in the second half. Mm, yep. You got it. 1611, right? Oh, swipe by Mitch. Mitch, I think, leading the uh, competition in steals today so far. Ties him up, and there was no foul call, and Thomas is looking <laughs> bewildered out there of <laughs> what happened. Confused in the baseline. Puts it up, misses, he'll do it again. Oh my, again. oh my. He'll do it a third time. Holy! I think he's in his cold stretch, Bob. 
Oh, but this one has a third one. Fancy moves can't handle it. Mitch with the ice cream stained shirt from last night. <laughs> and that's that was uh, two, so it's sixteen to thirteen. Oh, down low, moving around. Nothing doing. Hurts to exert that kind of energy and not come up with anything. Sure does. Doesn't it? I hate when that happens. Sure does. That's why you were sitting out there in the perimeter last game, I think. Right? That's right. <laughs> Conserving energy for one play. If I'm going to miss, I'm not going to use my energy. Hey, look, if I'm going to lose, I'm not going to lose, en <laughs> lose energy. <laughs> oh, oh, it's coming right at me. Oh. 13. Huh? Thomas? No, nothing. Rebound Mitch. Three point line. Mitch slightly above the three point line. Come back. Oh, with the fade, Miss. nothing. This is kind of how they started the game off, if I uh, yeah. remember right. Oh, what a and, weird move. Uh, and he doesn't even get it. No. You touch it? Oh. And then it rolled? Yeah. Oh, no, I thought he touched it I, right I before it, it went too, out. Yeah. But, um, I guess I guess where you, you touched touch it before it, it rolled out, and then it's it kept rolling. <laughs> he I admits see, it. I seriously don't know if I touched it, but if, if you guys... I mean, have, I don't know either. I, I just thought that's what happened. 16, 13. Right. It looked like you no did. Problem. I mean, there's... Well, I was going to say we there's could no check the video. Here. There's you no video. The <laughs> and stopping and okay. scoring. It's like two points there. 16, 15. It's a one-point game. Oh, and Mitch, Mitch takes he, the he, lead, giving all honor due to the rim on that one. Getting weird looks from passers-by, and he scores. 19 to 16. It's like if you had to choose uh, hot or not, I'd say hot for Mitch. <laughs> if you must choose, yes. <laughs> I wouldn't choose either, but <laughs> <laughs> if left with those two, yes. 21-16. He's in the home stretch, Bill. <laughs> wow. Wow, too easy. Too easy. 23-16. <laughs> Thomas doesn't look tired out there. Oh, I think he got a piece of that one. Yep. Twenty-three, sixteen. Mitch's ball. See what Thomas does. It's his chance. He's got a really. Oh, I don't know if that was the shot he was really looking for on that. That's a big. Oh no. All right, gives it back to Thomas on that one. <laughs> Into the road, hit by a car, and it's the game. It's called blood ball for a reason. So, really putting the blood in blood ball, eh? <laughs> What is his strategy? Down four, he's got 14 more points to the victory. He's seven points away from Mitch. 
Mitch is seven points away from the victory. What will he do? He's backing them in. Backing them, backing them, backing them. And the... No. Oh, my. And going for that three. Okay, I think we're switched to cold now. Twenty-three, eighteen. Mitch. Thomas's ball. Oh man, makes a gamble and loses. 23-20. Well, I'm a lot lankier than I think. I'm a lot shorter than I think. The tie. Wow. Oh, tie Big. 23-23. Closest game of Blood Ball, whatever number Blood Ball this might be. Closest. Closest in the history of the sport of basketball, I'd say it's tied up. It's <laughs> true. You can't really imagine a closer game than this. <laughs> and our one spectator is leaving the court. He's had enough. Oh my, fancy dribbling. Jackson. Wow, Three points. oh man, 26-23. Mitch has got some pressure on him now. He's gotta get a stop, I think. Was that a three? I believe so. That was a three. Cool 26 up. Win by two. Win by two. We can see this game extend. Oh my. Dribbling it very high right in front of the uh, defender there. Thomas didn't get the steal. Twenty-six up. That's a good shot, but it doesn't go. Ooh. Thomas not wasting any time to go for that three. 29-26. Point game here. And oh, oh my. Dang. Oh game my. 31-26, Thomas. Wow. I'll put the um umbrella down. You can, you can come to me. <laughs> And Thomas gets the victory. I don't know if you'd call this an upset. May, maybe, maybe not. Thomas, how do you feel? That was that was the closest game this year. That was a really <laughs> tough matchup. Uh, we you played before, like you said, and we always we always have good, hard, tough games. And I I just got lucky. It could have been either one of us right there. Do you uh, feel like both of you were were exerting your utmost and? Putting, putting your all out there for yeah, that we, one? We, we had a little history in the recent past, so yeah, we both really want to win this game. Uh, 
show to everyone else that uh, we're on top, but we both exert a lot of energy, <laughs> had a good time. <laughs> you look <Okay>. confused. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, well, congratulations on uh, two victories. You're up. You're, you're the man to beat right now. Right. And now we're going to Shell over here. A little disappointed with that, or, or is that kind of what you were expecting there? Because you uh, played Thomas before. Yeah, so he didn't, uh, uh, last time we, last couple times we played, he didn't really show the body too much. This is more aggressive on the body. Um, you think he's bringing that out for Blood Ball? He was kind of keeping that under wraps? Yeah, well, that's uh. good. I mean, it's good that he's doing that. It's a bit much for me, but I admittedly am, uh, I've always kind of played like no contact. Yeah. Which uh, is part of the reason that I've never got. You're good. a little dainty. Yeah, I'm a little dainty, definitely. So uh, any little, you know, elbow, shoulder shrug, or anything is usually enough to kind of like get me off. But um, more importantly, I think uh, I feel like um, Smoothie when he played me, because there's like a sense of like I just felt like uh, the whole time like yeah, I got this, so I'll just yeah. turn it on when I need to. But he's. Uh, Big and lanky enough on defense, and I'm slow enough. You notice I was like, all the dribbling through my legs and stuff is not being flashy. That's me trying to get my handle. Yeah. Um, and I figured it would be easy to do against him because he's not that aggressive. But uh, So you thought you'd easily catch up at the end. Do you think you let him go a little too far? Or you, uh, uh, clearly. you just didn't? No, I think I did it just uh. right. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I didn't think he did... hit the threes the way he did. Um, but clearly he shot enough that I should have you know, been more aggressive. And I was pretty aggressive, but I let him slide on a couple that I shouldn't have. And... Uh, yeah, you know, I just, it was like laziness, and uh, he pulled it out while I was sleeping. So uh, let's hope that doesn't happen next time. All right. Game three, all done. Thomas is up. Two victories. Mitch has two losses. And now it's going to be Darren and Zach.